So today I woke up at 5 a.m. for I think the fourth day in a row. Uh, I've been waking up every two hours in the night feeding a baby squirrel that we found that actually that Oliver found that he was really really stressed out because our dog was about ready to kill all four of them. He got one of them and then we saved three. All three of them lasted for a couple of days and then the weakest one died and then uh, a couple days later or about a day later the second one died and then we had one that we nicknamed or named Scrat from the movie Ice Age because the kids like that so I like it. In fact when Stephanie and I decided we were going to get serious about being in a relationship together. We um, we started that with our first date, dinner, and a movie, and the movie we went to see was Ice Age. So Scrat was pretty special to Oliver, but he was special to the family, and I was sad when I woke up at 5 a.m. for his feeding again, and I realized he had died, and uh, we lost all three of them. Uh, I spent... <laughs> Uh, so much money on cages and food and water bottles and um, I guess formula which didn't really take very well to be honest with you he uh, he got a lot of diarrhea and I think dehydration is what got him even though I kept water in this thing like crazy the towel that he was sleeping in to try to keep warm we had him on a in the corner of a heated blanket uh, to keep him warm as well uh, it was just, I think it was soaked in here, and he just, it just, whatever was in that formula uh, wasn't the right formula for a baby squirrel. And I did the research online, many, many hours, late nights. Eh, you know what? I'm really sad for Oliver. He wasn't crying this morning when he found out that he was definitely upset. Um, Willow doesn't know yet. She went to the sitter today without knowing that and she's going to be terribly upset but I will say uh, I'm traveling again in a couple of days so I'm not going to get much sleep because I never sleep well when I travel especially when I'm traveling to the other side of the planet I am glad though that I'm not going to have to wake up every two hours for a freaking tree rat <laughs> that's what I call them but I mean they're cute they are cute and he was a he was a pretty cute little pet, but he just, you know, he just wasn't going to make it. So we tried. I tried really hard, and I spent a lot of money. And I guess the reason I'm talking about this is because it's frustrating as a parent that really, as you can tell, I get broken up about it. I really try hard. I try really, 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 really hard to... Um, to do things to make my kids safe, comfortable, happy, and still teach them the tough lessons in life, the things that can make them harder, make them stronger, make them tougher, and withstand life, because life isn't easy. Life deals out blows like this all the time, it seems like, um, but it's hard as a parent when you try hard and you fail them. <laughs> even if it's something as silly as a squirrel. That's it for today. We'll talk to you later. Hope everybody has a great weekend.